What's going on guys, it's Beamer FPS here back with another video and today we're going to be showing you how to install this QB loading screen and we're going to edit it to our likings and uh, get that going. Alright, so after you download the QB loading screen from the description below, bring it on your desktop and then go inside your files. So if you go inside your server, go to your resources go to QB down uh, the QB loading that's in there right now and what, what I want you to do is just delete it bring the new QB loading in and after you bring it in what we're going to do now is we're going to edit it so what I want you to do is double click it and it will bring double click the index HTML right here and it'll bring it up to a Google and where you can see it so what this um, loading screen is, is slides and it shows you a discord and there's a video playing in the background. So if you go in the bottom right here, if you click it, different slide, let me show you the discord. If you want to join their discord and the third slide is the, the rules. Um, I did some tweaking to this to make it work more proficient and less errors when loading in. Um, but so we'll get to editing. So if you want to change the music, you could, if you want, you could just download an MP3 and just name it music and just drop it in here and it'll work. Um, for the two background images. So these are images, slide two and slide three are images. If you want to change those, you go to images and then background and then change these. So if you right click these and go to properties, these are JPEG files. So what I recommend you to do is get JPEG files, turn them into, if you have a PNG, turn it into a JPEG and keep it the same names as well. If you don't want to know, if you, unless you know what you're doing, um, I would keep them the same names to slide two BG, slide three BG. So you have no problems when installing it. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to open up the index. I'm going to open it up in visual. So you'll see there's a lot of notes here that I made. Um, so the first thing is, this is the title of the web page that appears on the browser tab. So right here, so you could change that. And then the loader text, the main title of the loader, and then the subtitle. And if you keep scrolling, they're kind of white, so you'll be able to see them. Discord and invite link, you could change that. If you keep scrolling down, this is the slide one. This is your YouTube video, which I'll show you how to change momentarily. So you would change this, the intro, the title, the description, and then the bottom, YouTube. And then this is your turn off music, if you want to change that. And then you scroll down to slide number two. This is your Discord. You could change this how you want. And then this is your Discord invite. And then this is also your logo for your Discord. So if you keep scrolling down, this is slide three for the rules. You can change this how you would like. If you don't even want to put rules on there, you don't have to. You can put whatever you would like. So next, after that, what we're going to do, we're going to go into the JS. We're going to go to savage.min. So the next thing what we're going to do is, as you see, it's left to right. Um, there's websites out there to make it top bottom if you would like. But if you keep scrolling over, keep scrolling, keep scrolling. And eventually you will see... something called right here yt player i'll have it in the description below but if you search just yt player there's a video id right here so what we'll do is we'll go to youtube and i'll grab one of my videos so i'll go to my video i'll just go to uh, click on this and what it will do 
is it will pull up an ID right here for you up in the URL. So everything after V equals you want to grab. So you got to remember. So if we remove this, it will be the normal video now. So this is the normal video starting. So anything after V equals, as you see, so we'll copy this and we will put it right here, right? And we'll save it. Keep it open just in case it don't work. So double click index. And now what you will see, it should change. There you go. Should change. And now what we'll now what we will do, since I changed everything I, I want, I will start up the server. And I will start up my 5M as well. This is one of the easier scripts, so. And next we're loading into the server. There it is. There you have it. Second screen third screen and there you have it guys i would like to say thank you guys for watching this video i know it was a short one um i'll try to have another video out in a day or two for you guys but i appreciate you guys watching um and i hope you guys enjoy if you have any suggestions please leave them below and as always we do have our own discord if you have any help if you need any help um please join there and if you have any suggestions you can leave them there as well as always i'll catch you guys in the next video peace